let's make you a winner. This is Peter Beckham, the Village Marketer. And today I want to share with you something that is extremely important. And I want you to listen to it carefully, especially if you are not achieving the success that you hoped and dreamed you would. There will be some home truths in here, something you might not even approve of, but I'm going to share it with you anyway. The greatest cause of frustration, failure, and fruitlessness for any business, for any entrepreneur, is an empty pipeline. The most important action you need to take is to reach out and make new connections daily. This is often referred to as prospecting, but don't let that get into your mindset, all right? You must be thinking serving, not selling. Prospecting is often associated with people trying to find someone to sell things to. I'm asking you to look for connections that you can serve and build relationships with. That will make it easier for you and easier for them as well. The question is, can you do it? Secondly, will you do it? And remember, the objective of every new connection is to get to the truth, not get to the sale. If you've got that clear in your mind and you truly believe it deep in your heart, then you should not have any problem at all in reaching out to as many people as you want on a daily basis because you're providing a genuine service. If you want a consistent cash flow business, with feelings of fulfillment, confidence, and abundance, then you must have a pipeline of ever-growing relationships. It makes sense, doesn't it? It's a critical daily commitment that you must make to yourself to open up new conversations and new relationships. It doesn't matter how long you've been in business. Failure to consistently connect with people is going to come back and bite you in the butt sooner rather than later. Not having people to talk to is going to play with your mind. You'll be thinking, what's wrong with me? You're thinking I'm a failure. You're thinking I'm losing confidence. You're thinking I'm not worthy. All these things are going to happen if you do not make consistent connections with people. So let's be honest. If you want to be a winner, then you need to build a community of potential clients. It doesn't have to be a formal community like a Facebook group, but that would help greatly anyway. But having a community that you can actually look at, okay? I mean, think about it. Just waking up each morning and having your diary showing book calls with potential clients will make a huge difference to your communication and your conversation skills. There's no doubt about that. Because your mindset will be one of, wow, I'm more relaxed. There's less pressure. There's less desperation, so to speak. All right. This is why it's so critical. This is also the reason why so many entrepreneurs fail. Because they come up with excuses not to do the things they need to do in order to dance, survive in the first place. That doesn't make sense to me. The number of book calls you have on your daily calendar is really up to you. And that depends on your business model. But having less than you need to be able to choose who you want to speak with is undermining your very business success journey. Having no pipeline of book calls all boils down to this. Lack of practice. Laziness and a reactive, not a proactive approach to making new connections. Making new connections must be, for you, a non-negotiable daily activity. Promise yourself there will be no more excuses. For example, stop relying on that one potential client you have to speak to, as it places you in an impossible position of panic and desperation. And despite your good intentions, that's going to show in your communications with them and in your conversations with them. You can't make a choice if you've only got one, right? And if you've only got one 
and that person says, no, where are you? So I strongly, strongly suggest you adopt a non-negotiable mindset and ask yourself every single day, what am I doing to open up new conversations today? What am I doing to provide a memorable experience for my new connections? What am I doing daily to nurture the relationships with the people I connect with? You may not like this, but you need to make networking and connecting the number one priority in your business. Think, how can you help others by connecting them to your network? The more you give, the more you get. Play the long game. Don't play the short game. And always remember that your existing clients need to be having memorable experiences with you on a consistent basis. They can be your most powerful source of new connections if you earn the right by giving them memorable, trust-based experiences. So, okay, maybe it's time for you to get off the complacency fence. If the, if the shoe fits, wear it, okay? I'm not sure whether you're complacent or whether you're lazy or whether you're scared or whatever it is, but you need to get off the fence. You need to take action. I mean, we all want to experience success and fulfillment. So starting today, no excuses, starting today. If you're not dealing with a consistent pipeline of potential clients, then you need to become much more self-accountable. And promise yourself right now to take the actions that you know you need to take. No more fear. You are providing an awesome service. No more excuses. Your reputation is at stake. No more complacency. You're running a business, not a hobby. Do this and you'll be sitting in the winner's chair before you know it. And remember, winners are winners. So let's make you a winner today. I hope you got value from that. Best wishes from Thailand. I'll talk to you next time. Bye for now.